Welcome to Coffee Plans. I'm Beth Coffee, and today we're going to have another loop group video for you. Um, this week we'll be planning the week of July 8th through the 14th, 2024. Um, I'm doing this way ahead of time because I've got so much going on. Today is the... 26. So I guess I'm not that far ahead. Just two weeks. This is sneak peek of what you'll see this video. You'll see this video before you see this video. So anyway, <laughs> I will be using a kit, a printable kit that I got from Beth and Beyond. She used to be called Dots and Beyond. And I'm on her Patreon and so I get these for free well included with my Patreon membership you can purchase these uh, from from her Patreon you don't have to become a member and you can purchase the kits this was her April 2024 kit but I'm using it for July but I'll show you some of the elements it's so pretty our theme this week is nautical so I thought this was fitting because see there's the the wheel and there's like a compass symbol with this turtle uh, Poseidon um, another compass and I just thought this was the closest thing I could find to something nautical and I like this pearl and this little wreckage and there's a boat a shipwreck here so yeah, this is this is what I'm using. I'm not gonna use all of it, so I will probably do another another spread with these. These I really like these, but I ended up not using them. But these were the date covers, day of the week covers, and the dots and weather. I really like her art, the art she puts together, and these are just some florals. Again, I'm not using these, but that's fine. I did use the washi. This one had anchors, and this one's got like bottles and a compass, or I guess it's a starfish. I don't know. But it was from the Aquamarine Door April 2024 mm -hmm. planner kit. She's doing a whole year based on the 10,000 doors of January. It's a book. So, okay. If you're new here hi welcome if you came from the previous video thanks for stopping by hope you enjoy my content um how it works is you watch my video hopefully you watch it all the way through start to finish like comment subscribe and in the description i will leave a link to the next video in the loop you go to that video do the same watch the video like comment subscribe Go to their description, follow the loop. If you make it back to the video, no, when you make it back to the video you started with, you have completed the loop and we appreciate all your support. These are hosted by the amazing creatively Lisa Marie. That is her user handle, username, what's it, her tag? I don't know, <laughs> I don't know on all the social medias, creative, Creatively Lisa Marie on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook. Check her out, she's awesome. I will have her Instagram linked below. Um, and we're just a bunch of planners that follow a theme every, every month. There's four groups, so each week of the month, well, most weeks of the month, there's a group for that. Um, she's going to make some changes to them where they're more theme specific for next year. But as for now, we're all kind of mishy mashy. Um, and we're, we're pretty small creators. There's some larger ones and some small ones like me, but we're, we're having fun and we're enjoying creating together, so to speak. So, all right. I've got my washi and my dates down. Let's see 
if there's any special holidays that match my color scheme. I've started doing that. I guess that's not good because there's fewer that I use. Uh, July 8th. <clears throat> Freezer pop day. Sugar cookie day. See, those don't match the theme. Kitten day. Mojito day. Simplicity day. And barbershop appreciation day. Oh, my son would like mac and cheese day. <laughs> Kitten day is cute, but no. Freezer pop day is the only one that matches it. I'm not going to make freezer pops. Well, we have some otter pops in the fridge, freezer, in the refrigerator. No, they're in the freezer. Okay, so then we look at my monthly, my birthday, and I fly away. <laughs> I'm going on vacation, which is why I'm filming these early. So that's the only thing I got going on. My birthday and my plane flight on the 13th. So I will be using my Sakura Sakura Pigma Micron in black and an Ohuhu marker in this blue color for my dots. So let's start with my birthday because it's my birthday. I'm going to put a piece of cake piece of cake on my birthday and some balloons. These don't really match my theme either, but that's okay. It's my birthday. Actually, I'm going to put this and I'm going to put it sideways. So it's just on that day. Okay. I'm happy to be back in the loop groups. I had stepped away because I knew I was going to be busy. But I missed it so much that... Um, I'm filming these videos ahead of time so I can be in the loops and and enjoy them again. So, okay. If you can tell, that's my birthday. <laughs> oh, I wanted to put the airplane. There's an airplane in this book. There is an airplane. Okay, I leave at 2 o'clock. So we're going to put this here and we're going to put the suitcase down here in the middle here because I'll be doing laundry and packing on those days. So let's put a dot here. I'll be gone for two weeks and so let's see we do dinner times around six o'clock so that's 18 so that right there is 18 so we'll do dinner dots and then we're gonna go out for my my birthday hmm I don't know but I'm not going to put dots down for Saturday or Sunday because I'm not in charge of eating and meals while I'm gone. Um, so, yay. <laughs> Somebody else is in charge of it. I will plan for the kids meals while I'm gone, but I don't have to cook them because I won't be here. Okay, so let's see. I wanted to put him down. Poseidon or Neptune or whoever he is and I didn't probably didn't do a very good job cutting these out the struggles of printing your own stickers did I not oh let me get my scissors
and cut this out if I can. Okay, let's see. Okay. Let's see here. Okay. I'm not the best at fussy cutting. I need to invest in a cutter and I, I don't think I want a Cricut. I had a Cricut when they first came out years and years ago. But, uh, yeah. So I might get a Brother Scan and Cut. That depends. I'm, I'm waiting to see how well I like the iPad I'm getting. Because if I don't like the iPad, I still have to buy my writing tool that I was considering. It's called a free write, but it's very expensive for a modern day typewriter for distraction free writing, which, okay, it's good. I need distraction free writing because obviously I'm, I'm easily distracted. So that's still on the table if I don't like the iPad that I'm getting for writing, which I, I think I will, but just in case, I'm not going to spend the money I've been saving until I know for sure, and I'll know that when I get it while I'm in Alabama on vacation. My friend bought himself a new iPad, so I'm getting his old, old like two years old um so yeah let me put this over the calendar because i don't use it there we go okay and i cut out the turtle So it'll be nice to not be responsible for feeding everyone and doing everyone else's laundry and all the stuff that I do on a day-to-day -day basis. I get a break for two weeks and I'm going to have some fun. I think we're going to go visit Gatlinburg um, for a few days. So he can have a vacation. My friend gets a vacation too because he's going to take me on vacation. So that's fun. That's fun. Okay, we'll put that right there. Is there anything else I cut out? Oh, yeah, the compass and the starfish. Yeah, my cutting skills leave a lot to be desired. <laughs> I do all right. I still haven't decided if, if it's worth my money to cut these out by myself or if buying stickers is more cost effective. I don't know. I need to calculate all that, see how much I spend on ink and, and stuff paper. I know I spend a lot of money when I do purchase items so I think it's probably cheaper to do it yourself. It's a little more time consuming but I don't know I don't mind doing it. Sorry this ship is not wanting to come out the paper. I use a gyro cut and it helps, but like I said, I want to invest in a cutter machine if I'm going to be dedicating the time and energy that would save me a little bit of time and energy to have a die cut machine, not die cut, a cutting machine. I'm going to leave that white. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. 
Okay. Oh man, my allergies have been really bad the last few days. We actually cooled off. It's not been over a hundred yet, so that's good. That's good. Cause it was hot here for a bit. All right, I'm gonna put that on there. Okay, I think that's all of those I wanted to put on. Oh, the octopus. Nah, I'm not putting the octopus. On. Not doing it. I do want to put this pearl. I cut these through the paper. I try not to press that hard, but sometimes, sometimes it happens. Okay, we'll put this one here. And then I wanted to do this statue, mermaid, mermaid statue. And we'll put that right here. Perfect. Okay. Um, I think that's it. So there we have it. My weekly plan for the week of July 8th through the 14th for the loop group. Hope you enjoy the videos in the loop. We sure have fun making them and... Yeah, we appreciate any and all support. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. See you in the next one. Bye.